Did you know that the surface of Earth changes? Some changes happen slowly, over hundreds or thousands of years. Other changes to Earth's surface can happen in just a few minutes or even seconds. Let's look at some of these quick changes and see how they happen. Volcanoes can cause quick changes to Earth's surface. Mount St. Helens is an active volcano in the state of Washington. A volcano is considered active if it has erupted in the last 10,000 years. This image was taken the day before it erupted in 1980. Before the volcano erupted, molten rock, or magma, had risen from deep underground. This created a growing bulge inside the volcano. An earthquake on the day of the eruption caused Earth's largest recorded landslide. The top of the volcano slid down the mountain at 70 to 150 miles per hour. Mount St. Helens released some of the built-up pressure in its magma system through explosions. These explosions sent rocks, ash, gas, and steam flying upward and outward at 300 miles per hour or more. This eruption dramatically changed the landscape. This is a picture of Mount St. Helen the day before it erupted. And this is a picture just a few days after it erupted. What differences do you notice? The mountain itself has a very different shape. One side of the mountain collapsed, causing a huge landslide. The rock and ash from the eruption spread out over 230 square miles. This debris destroyed the plants and trees. Some volcanic eruptions include lava flows. This changes Earth's surface in a different way. The lava cools and hardens, creating a new rock layer. Let's look at another kind of quick change. How did these cracks in Earth happen? An earthquake caused them. Earthquakes cause parts of Earth's surface to shake. As large parts of Earth's surface slip past each other, the energy shakes the ground. This shaking can create cracks in Earth's surface in just seconds. Earthquakes can also cause landslides. This is what Earth can look like after a landslide when a large amount of rocks and soil suddenly fall down a hill or mountain. Landslides make changes to Earth by reshaping the land in minutes or even seconds. Heavy rainfall can also cause landslides by loosening the rocks and soil on sloped land. Then gravity can cause the loosened material to slide down the slope. After a landslide, the slope will have a part that looks scooped out. That is where the rocks, soil, and plants used to be. At the bottom of the slope, there will be a pile of rocks, soil, and plants. Now you know that volcanoes, earthquakes, and landslides can change Earth quickly. Can you think of any other ways Earth's surface can change?